so hey guys how are you all hope you are good so we are back with our new editorial and we are discussing problem a gardener and the tree of code versus round 748 div 3 and let's read the problem throughout then we will go over one note to discuss this discuss it further a tree is an undirected connected graph in which there is no cycle okay there uh, this problem is about non-rooted tree a leaf of a tree is vertex that is connected with at most one vertex vertex a gardener badly grew a tree from n vertices he decided to trim the tree to do this he performed a number of operation in one operation he removes all leaves of the tree and then there are some operations let's move on to notepad to discuss this problem further so this is the problem and in this problem we are given a tree and we have to apply an operation k times on it on the tree okay so for ex and the operation is that we have to delete all the leaf nodes of the tree so what are the uh, in in after after k operation we have to print the number of nodes remaining in that tree so some of the guys might be wondering what is a leaf node if you guys know what is a leaf node you can skip it skip this portion and those who don't know let me tell you what is a leaf node the node having only one vertex connected to it is known as a leaf node for example in this tree uh, i is a leaf node h is a leaf node k is a leaf node j is a leaf node d is a leaf node f is a leaf node and that's it g uh, c j is not a leaf node because it is connected to c as well as k so it is connected with two and k is a leaf node because it is connected only with c so having uh, it is on the have the node having only one connected component uh, connected vertex is a leaf node okay so let's go over the approach of this problem this problem is uh, i would say is really simple so the approach of this problem is really simple we will have we will simply make a tree graph tree or a graph um basically tree is a um basically graph is a, a tree is a portion of a graph so tree or graph you can call it either anything uh, of all the given nodes uh, let me read it again approach of this problem is really simple we will simply make a tree graph of all the given nodes and then we will apply the operation until it is less than or equals to k uh, or if the number of operations number of nodes are zero then we will return zero so this basically means we will apply apply the operations k times and if in between we get to know that um in between only we get to know that our uh, tree has become empty then there is no point of doing further operations because we know that uh, after k operations also, also the answer will be zero and now only the answer is zero so we will return zero at that time okay so let's go over points how we will do its implementation so do this to do this we first need to count the degree of each nodes so degree of the node is the number of vertices vertices it is connected with so for example one is having the degree two because it is connected with 13 as well as two so it is having two so and seven is uh, having vertices uh, degree two and eight is having degree three can anyone guess in the comments what is the um degree of four and yeah it's three because it is connected with two three and five two five and six okay so this is what the degree is we will make and the second step is we will make a set or a vector of nodes having degree one for example four 14 is having degree one 11 is having degree one 12 is having degree one so degree one uh are having uh vertices are those vertices which are leaf nodes so leaf nodes are going to have degree one so this is a key point and we will make a set or vector of those vertices for example we will make a vector of 14 11 12 5 6 9 and 10 
because they are the ones having degree one and then we will run a loop from one to k each time we will do the following operation okay so in our loop what we are going to do each time we will go over the vertices having degree one in our set which are basically we will mean that we will go over every leaf node so we will go over 14 11 12 5 and so on so first let, let's talk about 14 and then we will decrease the degree of nodes it is connected to by one so let me just explain what does this mean so this means that uh, the graph which we have made here we will take a use of it in uh, that graph the no nodes which are connected to 14 we will decrease its degree by one for example the nodes which is connected to 14 is 13 right so the degree of 13 was 2 then we will make the degree of 13 of 2 by uh, degree of 13 which was 2 mm, we will decrease it by 1 so if we decrease 2 by 1 then it will be 1 right hmm. and similarly we will do this for all the vertices which um, 14 is connected with and then we will go over 11 then we will check for 11 how many vertices it is connected with and all those vertices are going to decrease its degree by one we are decreasing degree by one because if you see it if we de uh, delete this vertex and uh, then we will see that this vertex is going to till and this vertex is going to delete decrease one of its vert uh, vertices or degree so we have the total number of connected component it is having is one which is one right so that's why we are decreasing it and then we will update our set or vector whatever set or vector was com containing was it was having the number of uh, number of vertices having node uh, having degree one so we will update it because uh, the the vertices which were having degree one before are now not present in the set this so we have to delete that set and then we have to create a new set which was having degree which uh, which will contain the nodes which are having degree one so what how we will go in this is like is this okay no it is not okay so what we will do is we will first delete 14 then we will delete 11 then we will delete 12 then we will delete 5 then 6 then 9 and then 10 okay and in this operation first operation and then in the second operation what we will do is we will delete 3 and 13 3 4 8 7 and in the uh, no, not 7 till 8 and then in the sixth operation and the sorry in the fifth operation we will delete in the next operation we will delete what the heck is happening okay in the next operation we will delete 1 and 7 and after that in the last operation we will delete 2 okay so this is how i know my drawing is a bit, uh, very bad please bear with me i will learn it by hand so at the last we will print the number of remaining nodes so this is the this much is the approach then then let's go over the code now okay you will understand better by code okay so this is the code i have inputted n and k n is the number of vertices and k is the operations that we have to perform adj is my uh, what we say tree or graph dc is the degree of each component and this is a special case where n is one then we will increase the degree of one by one okay then let's go over the for loop we will input our uh, vertices and then we will um update our graph then we will increase each uh degree uh, degree of each component which is coming by one each vertex which is coming by one then this is a set i have used set instead of vectors here you can use anything you can use vector as well in place of set and i use two sets cv and nc uh, i will take uh, cv is the components which are having degree one 
okay in my graph and nc i will tell you later so uh, ab is the number of uh, number of vertices in in current that means how many vertices are there in our graph currently that is what a v is and then um, we will run a loop from 0 to k or 1 to uh, 0 to k minus 1 or 1 to k you can imagine like this like that and then if a v is 0 that means our size of our graph is 0 that means there is no node in our graph then we will break it else uh, we are going to go over the leaf nodes leaf nodes means cv which is having degree one the, all the nodes for example we will go over 14 here was 14 if you can't see it sorry about that and yeah so 14 and 11 and 12 and so on we will go over that and then after that we will decrease our and decrease the value of our graph by one because we are basically deleting this node and then after deleting this node we are updating the nodes connected to it updating the degree of nodes connected to it which means uh, this is basically the nodes connected to x x means uh, the values connected to it and then u means u means the value connected to it x means the node which we are currently on and u means the nodes connected to it so we will decrease it and if the node of the value is equals to one node of that particular value is equals to one uh, degree of that particular value is equals to one then we will add it into nc nc is the new uh, new set which is going to have value one which is going to have the which is going to become the leaf node okay and then we will decrease the degree of x which means the degree of leaf node which is going to become zero and then we will update the vector of leaf nodes and then we will clear the new vector of leaf nodes or set of leaf nodes and at the last we will print the size of our uh, size of our um what we will say is size of our graph okay so hope you guys enjoyed it it was a bit tired full explanation um sorry about if sorry about that if you got any uh disturbance in between and i will try to improve my uh presentation from next time and yeah if you like this video don't forget to like share and subscribe and uh, meet you guys next time i will look, if you have any doubt don't uh, you can post them in the comment section i will definitely reply to them and yeah meet you guys next time till then bye bye